Hey everybody, this is Mike. Today I would like to show you the Johnny six foot hoop bender. I'm gonna show you the process I use. I'm bending my hoops for my garden each step of the way. And at the end, if you decide that you'd like to have something like this for yourself, for your garden, I would go over to johnnyseeds.com and pick yourself up one. Okay, let's bend a hoop. I'm gonna show you how to put the conduit in the hoop bender where it should be placed. Set the conduit right here in the middle, these two bars. And you want the end of the conduit, even with the end of the bender, it's right here, right here at the end. Then you wanna put a little pressure on it so it don't go anywhere. And that's how you start your first setup of the bender right there. I'm gonna reset the camera up and I'm gonna show you how to turn it, how to move the conduit around the, the bender. Okay, now let's make a hoop. Now that we have the conduit placed in the right spot, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this half inch conduit and we're gonna pull it all the way around until it touches the end down here on your first bend. So, then you release, and then you bring the conduit through, like that. And here's where you're going to need someone to help you to hold this end, because if that end of that conduit drops like, like that, what's going to happen is you'll have a hoop that's bent like this, and it'll look more like a coil or a spring. So you want to keep it level to this plane here, so when you hold it, it needs to be level so your hoop is straight. Okay, for the next bend, the conduit's being held level down there where Jackson is. He's holding the, the out feet of it, and that needs to be held level. He's doing a great job. So now what you do is you want to pull the conduit to you about five to six inches, about all you want to go, then release it. And then bring more conduit in. And you do the same thing. He's gonna hold it level as, as straight as he can anyway. It don't have to be perfect. And you wanna pull it again to about five or six inches from hitting here. So I'm gonna do it one more time. Another little short run. Pull again. Four to five inches. Okay, for the last bend, we're gonna use what's called a, a, a conduit bender. It comes with the six foot bending uh, jig. You simply just slide the conduit in the end of the pipe here. Like so. Now on this last bend, the end of this tool, the bender, needs to just clear the end here to complete your your hoop. So it takes a little bit of eyeballing. So you just finish it out, you bend it all the way around, like so, like that, and just pull it all the way to the end. Release it, take the end off. Jackson will take the hoop out, 